welcome back to Pillars of Eternity. So last time we went into the ruins uh, running from a storm called Beowick uh, and I guess we were <laughs> kind of happy to be alive but when we got to the other side of the ruins uh, we lost our party members they are lying on the ground dead as I don't know what so I guess there is nothing else to do but to loot their corpses mm, yeah don't get far like this I don't really know how the equipment works. It looks like whenever I get too much uh, item, it's just transferred to the stash automatically. I guess so. Perhaps I should uh, equip a bow or something. Could make sense like this and we are fatigued mayor fatigue so let's uh, use oops okay so this is the visions we are getting I guess let's just use stealth mode and uh, loot some on our way. Okay, what's okay? Guess I got some vessel of flesh. Hello, hello. Okay. Strange, strange, strange things are happening. And we have uh, some spring berries. That's good for tummy aches. I've learned from this game. And some more loot. Hmm. Okay, so we can uh, leave uh, the ruins. And we are supposed to go to the Gilded Whale. So we will have to go through the Whale Wood, I guess. Yeah. It will take you six hours to complete your journey from. Excellent list to Veilwood. Let's do it. Oh, rest would be good. Rest would be good, yeah. So let's just rest, I guess. Oh, is this this zero? That's perhaps the, how many times I can use my spells. So let's uh, level up first. So now we get to place some points in our skills, or like our secondary skills, I guess you can say. I am thinking about uh, using lore and mechanics as my main things. So I can lockpick and uh, handle traps with mechanic skill and uh, lore to, well, I mean. I'm supposed to be a druid, so I need to have some lore, I guess. And then we will also get some hmm, talents. Looks like. So, what's this all about? So we can have talents that's bound to our class, or we can have Offensive talents, defensive talents, and utility talents. Talents. So, hmm. yeah, it's a uh, kind of interesting. I have to say. Hmm. 
I guess these uh, class talents should be quite interesting. So we can get uh, additional damage when we are spirit shifted. So my spirit shift is a boar that looks like some kind of zombie boar, I guess. Were boar, since it walks on two legs. I mean, shock sounds perfect. A boar shooting lightning, lightning, yes please. Otherwise I could go with, for example, dual wielding or two-handing or things like that. Yeah, I mean, it's not bad, I guess. I could go with, try to focus on weapons, but I think that I have to go with if I'm going to fight in, in melee, I will use a uh, animal form. So, I mean, makes no sense not to. Not to take it, I have to say. Yeah, let's just go with. Uh, Lightning shooting boar. Like that. And then we should rest. So is this the camp button? Okay. So I had a kind of a bad dream or something, I guess. Oh well. Can I... I was thinking about if I could move to the east, but it looks like I can't. Nope. We have a corpse. Interesting. Yeah, we have some camping supplies. Could uh, use my... Um, Late uh, warrior scale armor. It's a little bit heavier, I think, but should be okay. Yeah, so I can see now I have three charges of these spells. So that's cool to know. I mean, it's okay to have three, I think. Because I can always rely on my spirit shifting to the board. Hmm. There's someone that sees me? No, it was just a spirit perhaps. I'm a little bit uh, concerned being solo like this. Some loot. And we have an outlaw. Don't know if I want to. Can I walk over here? Don't, I'm not too keen on fighting yet. Just get my bearings straight. Some more loot. Bear cave. Yeah, I mean in um, my first run of uh, Baldur's Gate, I made a fighter character, moved out into the forest, got a random encounter with one <laughs> one wolf like this, and I had. 10 health points and he quitted me for like 8 I think and then he killed me with the next attack so I got like 
two-shotted by the first wolf in the game. So that was just crazy. I, I don't like that I cannot use this out of combat. Okay. That's one angry boar, I have to say. Quickly and quietly. Okay, some more strange like I don't know what you can call them. But visions I guess. Okay. Hail and well met. Anonton. This man appears to be hurriedly dismantling his camp in quick, jerky moments. He looks up as you approach, his expressions tense and drawn. Greetings, he says, a little breathless. On your way south, is it? He wipes his brow, turning to face you. The sooner you're clear of these woods, the better, I think. What's your hurry? I mean to follow my own advice. Came out here on a hunt, me and a friend of mine. Thought we'd bring a stag home, eat something other than bread for once. Came up on a bear instead. Great monstrous thing. Yeah, that's the bear cave, I guess. And Pearly, he didn't make it. He shakes his head. I don't know what I'll tell his wife. In any case, this forest already cost me a friend and I'm heading home before it takes anything else. Who are you? Name's Nonton. Born and raised in Gilded Whale. Haven't had a spot of luck since. Luckier than Pearly, I suppose. In any case, this forest cost me... Okay. What happened to your friend? We didn't see it coming. We were following a stag. Pearly, he saw something in the brambles. And he, we went tearing off after it. We all but stumbled into the cave. Poor Pearly didn't stand a chance. The bear was on top of him before we knew what was happening. The beast will take what they will, I suppose. And this time, Galloway's favor fell upon the bear. The beast, okay. Where did you find this bear? In a cave, a ways up that way. Points northwest, yeah. I wouldn't seek it out if I were you. It was a great brute of a beast. Would hate to hear that it took another life. Okay. I just uh, take some river river reed, I guess, so I can continue south. Gilded whale. Let's just check, yeah, I have this area. I met the outlaw over here. Time to see and not be seen. Yeah, there he or she is. Oops. It's almost spotted. Hmm. After the Oops. Yeah, reloading after the um, oops, reloading after that um, crossbow attack it took huh? quite a long time. Okay, so he got some nice loot, sugar. <laughs> okay, move speed, some fish. Time to see and not be seen. Okay. Yeah, some kind of guy up there. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have a wolf. Just one wolf. Hmm.
No, not the only one wolf. Oops, three wolves, okay. So... They're all the same at least. Oh, now I have uh, quite a lot of information in the top left side. I can't show it, show it with uh, the mouse pointer because it will... But it's over here when I um, hover over them. Not that I really know what these uh, things mean. I guess it's like uh, physical protection and... Uh, I guess I can check my own... Yeah, here it is. So, we have deflection, that's like against uh, melee attacks and things like that. And we have fortitude, reflex and will. So, uh, these wolves have like average in everything I guess. But if I use a spell, for example the stancing bolts, the defense is reflexes, but uh, the boar tusks are against deflection. So yeah, it's good to know. Uh, this <laughs> this boar Got it. ability is just crazy. This age walls appears to have once encircled this entire glade. Only a small fragment remains, and the stairs leading to the top of the structure has crumbled away. The heavy bricks are slick with moss, presenting a hindrance to climbing, but the stones themselves seem sturdy enough. Given the right tools, one might easily reach the top. You'll find the handhold upon the large stones and start to pull yourself up. But the uneven bricks and odd angle of ascent make the climb difficult. And after a short distance, your arms begin to burn too fiercely. You are forced to drop down to the ground. Okay, so I guess I have to find a better tool or better stats. Uh, I have quite okay um, stats for, uh, I mean, might and things like that. I guess climbing is more uh, dexterity or athletics. Well, dexterity is more like how skilled you are with small motions, I guess, and athletics is more yeah, climbing. It says in the tooltip scrambling up fallen statues. Statues. Yeah, so I need higher sure. athletics. Whoa. Quickly and quietly. Okay, so we have uh, three dudes, four dudes, three dudes, one dwarf. Let's talk with them. Or not. The young dwarf tending to the stew looks up, startled, as he sees your approach. He drops his ladle, spreading stew across the ground. What? Get him, you dogs! And make sure our new cook doesn't run off, okay? So the dwarf is cooking and they are making him cook? What? Help, please me! Mwah! One of the bandits give ten fifth a kick as they pass him and he huddles. Okay, I know his name already, that's nice. Yeah, so three guys. Is there... Oh yeah, I can see the speed of the casting, I guess. Because I'm thinking that I will kind of need some kind of spell for this. There is a ranged guy over there. I wonder if this will damage him as well. Hmm. Yeah, I 
Yeah, it did. <laughs> Oops. Come on, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm helping. I'm helping. I have to pause all the time so I don't start hitting that uh, wolf dude. Can I disengage some somehow? No. Hmm. He's quick. Charm beast. Come on. Hmm. We won't disengage anytime soon. One quick fellow. You cannot venture forth. Nope. Okay. And now I don't have any. What and my beast thingy is uh, used up. Okay. Let's uh, try dancing bolts, I guess. Do we have any single target? All, all these uh, AOE attacks, it looks like they are. Try this one. There's quite a lot of um, um, reset timing after casting a skill. Task failed. Late for dinner. Hmm. Late for dinner. Well. I don't know. I cannot see. Um, Like uh, anything I have already done, so okay. too bad. But now I know that uh, there is friendly fire, Quickly and quiet. or at least uh, friendly fire against um, uh, non-playable characters. I guess it might be. Uh, Hmm. Might be possible to use AOE attacks without killing my um, friends, but these natural guys seem to die <laughs> and they get pretty upset with me shooting uh, like um, frost in their face so too bad my first mission uh, failed let's go to the gilded whale and cry a bit I guess eight hours let's go So we are okay. We got the whole place mapped already. It's nice. But uh, let's finish this part out up now and continue in the next one. So thank you and goodbye.